What's going on everybody? It's your boy Vix. I just saved my bitch, so I'm gonna look if I've got any decent upgrades. This um, upgraded attack looks pretty awesome, so I'll take that. Stop five crimes. I think I can do that with ease. So guys, I'm hungry and I'm planning to go eat pot noodle. And if you guys really want a pot noodle, put... Uh, I'm not giving away a pot noodle. That would be stupid. Oh my god, look at that little jumpy thingy that I did on a scone now. So it, I've got a time it just right, I don't even know what to call it. So okay, let's let's own these guys. Spider-Man for the win. And uh, just, just you know, HD Spider-Man gameplay. I hope you guys are enjoying the series. If you aren't, well, uh, COD's getting really boring. I don't mind playing Spider-Man again. I just like swinging around, messing around. Just, you know, being a superhero. I mean, the game's fun. I, I like the game. It's good, it's good fun. Um, there's different stuff, there's different ways to play it, and it, there's different endings if you guys didn't know. I think there's a total of four endings in this game. Uh, one's good, one's a uh, semi good, not completely good, one's bad, and one's really bad. So, th those are the endings if you guys were interested. If you weren't, well, I included them anyway. So, we're just swinging around and stopping the crimes, and you've got to do these like little side missions a lot, and uh, I, I don't really mind them because the side, mis the side missions, in my opinion, make sense, because uh, there's like a storyline to this game. Obviously, there's a storyline, and it's not like, it's, I guess it's not like regular campaign storylines where you're, you're usually directed. You can do the storyline missions if you want to, or you could just swing around the whole New York City and uh, I don't know, kill enemies whenever you want to. Uh, gameplay I do like, uh, quality as in uh, you know the graphics and stuff. Is it is it good? Is it bad? I don't I don't really know, guys. I think it's okay graphics. It's not it's not the best. And Spider Man, in my opinion, doesn't have to be 1080p graphics because when I was a kid, I watched Spider Man on this channel called Fox Kids. Uh, people from the UK may know know Fox Kids. Fox Kids was a uh, I think it was on 609 or 610. And that used to be the channel where I watched Spider-Man, and Spider-Man was crap, crap cartoon quality. I think it's on YouTube if you just search Spider-Man series, and it was crap quality. It was nowhere near proper HD quality. It was fuzzy, and I still watched it because I just enjoyed the Spider-Man storyline. Uh, it's probably because I had a shit TV as well at the time. I think it was a Panasonic. Um, it was just a big ass, you know, when the TVs were big boxes and they weren't plasma screen TVs. That's the, like the TV I had. Now everyone has a plasma because they're cheaper and it's just more. It just looks better as well. Anyway, back to Spider Man. Spider Man. Um, it, it's. <laughs> I just love pressing Y because right now, if um, if you guys don't know. By pressing Y, you usually like launch the zip web attack effect. But since I'm not trained with Luke Cage, which will be in the near future, I learn my web zip attack, and uh, then I can press Y to launch a web zip attack. Right now, it's just a single kick, so it's just like I'm kicking people in the balls. So if I do do it again, I'll try and point it out. If I don't, I don't. And uh, well, that's it. Okay, that was quick. Let's go back to Luke Cage. And I was saying before, no one commented on it. Who would win, guys? Who would win? Um, Luke Cage or Hulk? I mean, Hulk is pretty powerful, in my opinion. He's just like a Hulk is basically just walks through everything like a tank. But he can get hurt by bullets and stuff. He does bleed, and he's it's normal skin. Whereas Luke Cage has got steel skin, and uh, I just want to know, maybe. Luke Cage doesn't have the strength, but he does have like the defense, in my opinion. I mean, he's got the steel power and stuff, and he might just he, he Luke Cage is literally a tank because his skin steel. I don't know what kind of superhero he is, and over here I always go for, go for like a perfect landings. I usually fail, but I try my best, and here we go. The gangs are thinking twice before having a shootout in the middle of the street, but we have to keep up the pressure. Tell me about these gangs. They are engaging in a number of activities dangerous to the community. Your unique skills could be perfect for stopping them. Luke, you've been at this for a while now. Trying to get these gangs to calm down, I mean. It's an ongoing job, Spidey. I had a piece working, and someone decided they were disrespected. And now they're trying to get revenge. That's just stupid. That's life, man. I grew up in a nice, quiet corner of Queens. So you have no idea what I'm talking about. That's one way of saying it. Sure. These kids think they haven't got any currency beyond respect. They don't see any way out, and no future beyond what they can carve out for themselves. And their solution is to turn the city into a war zone? They don't think beyond today. That's why I'm out here, to show them there's another way. There's a future. Well, I've got your back, man. I want to help any way I can. There's some guys out here that need to get got. Knock some heads together, yeah? But most are just guys who've fallen in with the wrong crowd. And they just need to hear some kind words. Hey, Luke. 
What did you mean when you said I had unique skills? You have the potential to be a great fighter, but you need to use all your senses. Hey, I've got more sense than you. Excuse me? You know, my spider sense. One of these days, I'll think of something cooler to call it. Fine. Good. You got an extra sense. Now use it to its full potential. What do you mean exactly? You can see all your opponents before they see you. Figure out who you take out first. And I need that exact skill right now. What do you need? I've got an informant in serious danger. There's a hit about to go down, and I have no way to spot the shooter until it's too late. I could use my spider sense as a sniper sense. Nice. Exactly. And you can bet there'll be more than one. Now I'll tell you where the informant is, and then you can stick it out. Okay, let's do this. Okay, that was a usually long pause. I was trying to hold my blef breath through all that, and it was not easy at all. So, in this game, I'm trying to, you know, when, when it's like a speaky part or it's a cutscene, I try not to talk at all because it might interrupt you guys when you're actually really into the game. And uh, that's how I roll. But there are some, there's no subtitles in this game, but, you know, when you initiate a conversation, unless it's a cutscene, they, they, they like, don't, they don't, it's not like a cutscene, but like like with Luke Cage when I was talking with him before, he was just like with the white lines below him and you could see what the hell the text was or what he was saying. So you don't need subtitles for little um, side events like that. I will try because in this game there are options where you can choose to do um, different chat options like with Wolverine there's this really funny one about MySpace and it's really funny it, it makes me laugh and here we go to start a mission. Cutscene time shut up. This is the place. So many people though. Spider Sense do your thing. Okay, let's talk. Okay, blue is civilians. I already know this. I know this like by heart now. Now here, here where is like the lock-on system gets really annoying. It's just it, it pisses me off when I'm trying to kill one enemy who's like the hardest to kill, but it locks into like a side enemy because they attack me in hordes. It's not too bad, but it does piss me off a little bit. And uh, I can change by pressing the right stick, but it's a bit of effort. And uh, when there's a shitload of enemies and it goes to the wrong one. Okay, let's do this, Spidey. Let's kill these guys. Bam, bam, bam. I love how it goes in slow mo. Okay, here we go. Next target. Oh, what a fail, Vix. What a fail. <laughs> I tried to kick him and I just like slid on the floor. Shut up. Stop shooting at me. I mean, these bullets don't harm me. It's like I'm, I'm invincible. I'm like dodging the bullets in my day. I am getting hit by them because my health does go down. And if you are wondering, the health is the green and the red one is my special meter. I don't know why they've done that, but. Yeah, who cares? And this is the end of the part. Cutscene, but in a bit, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed. Please like, favorite, and subscribe. Don't thank me. Thank Mr. Cage.